Welcome back to Keen 5. It is a beautiful sunny day here on planet Korath. And I am standing atop the Korath 3 base. The secret level. Let's take it on. Keen faces danger in the secret Korath 3 base. <gasps> it's a tiny Scotsman. What are you doing, little fella? Isn't he just cute? These guys are called, uh, Korats. And they don't hurt me per se, they will push me around. And since I have a lot of lasers and, uh, sh uh slice stars and stuff around, some of these guys are gonna have to get zapped. But generally they're harmless. to get your pogo out so you land safely. And now that I'm at the bottom of this place, time to go back up. Nope, nope, nope. I don't trust it. Let's try that again. There we go. So this place can be kind of difficult in a few spots. Overall, it's not as hard as, well, at least the last couple that I've been through, so, you know. Shouldn't be too much of an issue, hopefully. Alright, a blue gem holder. Needing a blue gem. Now, check this out. See the score? A million points! Woohoo! The second time in my life I've reached a million points in a king game. Now, these lasers. Oh, these lasers. We're saving in front of these lasers. I just was not quick enough. There we go. Now. Alright, gotta zap that one so he doesn't push me into, you know. Uh, you get zapped too. So, let's go down and get that yellow gem. Let's try to go down and get the yellow gem. These two lasers seem to change their pattern every time you come across them. So that it's a bit hard to memorize anything here. Oh, I should point out these, uh, these Korath guys will knock me off a pole if the situation arises, so... They might, they might appear harmless, but they can be dangerous. Ah, see, now the lasers are doing a different thing. A different, easier thing now. Now I have to get by them one more time. Not too hard. How's the ammo? 20. Not bad at all. This is a nice level to come across if you're uh, low on ammunition. You get quite a bit here. Anyway, it's time for another save, I think. Because I'm about to face more great danger. Hey, 
a good thing I saved, huh? No, 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 that was almost terribly bad thing to do. Load this time. <laughs> There, that's what you want. All right. I'm not so sure about this bagpipe stuff. I mean, I like real life bagpipe music, but this is, I think, getting a bit repetitive. We might have to change it. Don't forget there's a laser there, like I almost just did. That could have been bad. Oh, that was bad. Damn it. Try again. Back up one more time. I don't think I need to save in front of that laser that just killed me. I think I just need to time it properly. And I should have it. I've actually practiced this level quite a bit. It's just, uh, it's just got some certain little situations that are just kind of... Deceptively easy looking, I think. There we go. Uh, jump up on, oh, not not grabbing ledges, jumping, jumping and and not grabbing. You know what? I think that extra life can just stay there. time too. I was gonna run out of ammo if I had to try that a few more times. Okay, okay. You guys want to change the music? I'm changing the music. No. Actually, you know what? First, before I put new music on, let's do this. Okay, let's get some new music going. That's better. Not that I don't like bagpipe music, I, I do. 
fact, I was watching a YouTube video one time of a guy who was playing bagpipes, and he looked like a big scary Viking guy. And he was playing ACDC, and he had flames coming out of his bagpipes. It was awesome. Okay. Time to start. Time to start paying attention to what I'm doing, I think. Because this is where things are going to get kind of hairy. Oh, and I almost forgot. The tart sticks in the wall. What? Unknown number. Don't know who it was. <laughs> I just screened him. Don't. Okay. Alright. Pogo away. Calling me while I'm making a keen video. It looked like it said 555. Isn't that a fake number? I don't know. Okay. So. Time for some slice stars. You're behaving badly today. Sometimes something that might help with this slice star. Sometimes it'll just get stuck in a rotation and just keep doing that same thing and you can never, it's impossible to get by it. So sometimes you have to uh, reload there and it'll, it'll change its pattern. We'll see if that works. It's been a while since I did any just regular pogo stick jumping like this. Ever since I discovered the impossible pogo trick, I kind of stopped playing that way. Alright, wee little Scotsman. Oh, I think it's going to change its pattern. Yes, yes, yes. Here we go. Okay, I'm going to save again just to keep things, you know, keep moving, but, uh... The Slice Star is now doing what it's supposed to. It should come down here. At which point I can hopefully start to outrun it. Oh! You came out of nowhere. It's alright, we can do this. Just gotta be ready. Come on down. Perhaps you misunderstood me. I said, come on down. Hey, talking to you up there. You're supposed to come down here so I can... Oh, jeez. Let's try something. Come on. Come on. Come on. Here we go. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. No, I think it's stuck in its pattern this time. This is the way I found to get by this. You just keep... Oh, here we go. You go that way, I'll go this way. Up. Yeah, I'm on to you this time. Uh, I missed the pole. Go, 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 go. Ah, you little shit. This is the hardest part of this whole level, so once I get past this, I'll have it made. Just getting past this is uh, evidently easier said than done. Get down here. 
Nope, you're stuck in your pattern again. Kind of holding up the video there, bud. Everyone, we're all waiting on you there, Mr. Slice Star. Anytime you want to quit being selfish, trying to be a YouTube star, this is not your channel, this is mine. We're all here to watch me play Commander Keen 5, not you. <laughs> Just, oh boy. Okay, go, 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 go. All right, made it. Woo! I think that earns a save, doesn't it? Yes, I think so. Uh, much better. Well, let's move on. Oh, right, the Hamptons. Oh, this song. I forgot to say the name of this song. This is called Mountain Pass Theme, and it's from the game Super Amazing Wagon Adventure. And, uh, it's one of my favorite video game songs ever. Okay, if I can get by the... No, I can't. There's four Amptons up there, and they, uh... They behave just like Amptons, so, uh, yeah. You think it's safe? I think they're waiting up at the top for me. There we go. There's two of them. Oh, you were going to come over here and climb up the pole I was on, weren't you? Yeah, I'm on, I'm on to your tricks there, Ampton. I mean, don't worry. We're, we're still cool. I still like you guys, but I know what you're up to. Shush. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> I didn't mean it. You're one of the good slice stars. I like you. I don't know. I guess I just ran out of things to say. <laughs> Jumping works better if you make weird noises while you're doing it. Okay. Should I say, all right, Dan, you've come a long way. Oh, I'd say if I was you. So this spot, this spot, when I first encountered it, it looks like it's just incredibly complicated, but it's really not. You just bounce right up the middle. And now I have to fall back down. Get your pogo out so Keen doesn't hurt himself when he lands. Keen does not take fall damage, but you know, doing that's incredibly hard on his knees and when he grows up, he's gonna have knee trouble and we'll, we'll, we're gonna try to prevent that if we can. Oh, you know what time it is? Yeah. This is just the funnest thing in the world. Ah, 
All right, we made it to the top. The exit lies just up above. However, I do believe we're gonna save, yes. What the? I'm out of ammo. Well, that's no good. Luckily, I know where there's more. I can't get by those slice stars without it. Um, but yeah, there's the exit door right up there, but uh, that's that's actually not the way I'm going to exit. There is another. There's a there's a fuse up here. Not sure what it's for. But if I can manage to bounce myself up here, first off, 45 ammo. I wasn't worried. And a fuse. He's making noise when you jump on them. Wonder what that fuse was for. I don't know. Either way, we broke it. Thumbs up. And we step back out onto Korath 3. Let's just take a second here and admire the view because, well, I like planets and stuff. Anyways, now we are back to the Omega Matic. We found out what that thing does, and uh, we've made it to the top. I do believe next time I see you, we're gonna wrap this story up, and then it's on to the next Let's Play. So, uh, until then, thanks for watching. My name's Hair Monster, and uh, I'll catch you on the flip side.